We're the land of the free, the home of the brave. See, if you want to be successful, you just work hard and save. That's the American dream. It sparked all kinds of rage with maximum work for minimum wage. You make 15 bucks an hour, but you only bring home a 10 spot. So you work 40 hours, get paid. Then what? That plan has never worked. Not one time, not ever. You could take 15 people, put them together. You, you know what? Forget that. You could take 25. They still wouldn't have enough to survive. Because if you're aiming to work hard for money, you'll miss. Hard work doesn't look like this. Hard work looks like this. The average nurse works a 12-hour shift. For the average CEO, it's roughly a fifth of that, but those couple of hours earn a lot more zeros. We pay these people next to nothing, but we call them our heroes. He has 13 confirmed terrorist kills. He has a medal of honor, and he can't pay his bills. He's behind on rent he shouldn't even be paying. It is someone else's asset. Please hear what I am saying. I am no better than you. I'm not brighter or smarter, and I won't even tell you that I've worked any harder, but I did take action. I listened and I learned because I had a drive inside of me that festered and burned to do something better because that plan is a lie. Work 40 years, retire and die? No thanks. I'm done with that. I cannot take it anymore. Republicans and Democrats, how about the rich and the poor? The true struggle that we can't see because we're blind that Fox News and CNN are just the curtain we're not supposed to look behind. Well, I took a peek. I learned how to truly own things and not just to buy stuff. I learned to weather the storm when the sky is rough because I can buy another house every couple of years. It's owning assets that mitigates fears. And I know you're scared. I don't blame you. These words are not meant to embarrass or shame you because I have been in the exact same place that you're going through. There is a better way, I promise. I'll show you.